Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as promised, I have a little tutorial for you today. It's obviously about Instagram filters and how you can create a beautiful lip gloss or metallic lips effect for your beauty filter. So let's jump right into it. And let me first mention that in case you are new to all these uh, Instagram filters world, of course, the first things you need to do is to download your Sparkar application. I'm gonna leave the link down below in the description box for you to easily install this application, which is absolutely necessary for you to create any type of Instagram or Facebook filter. So once you have that done, we need to use a little bit of Photoshop as well, but don't you worry, you don't need to have um, amazing experience at all. You can be a total beginner as long as you have Photoshop or any other editing software, whatever is available to you at the moment so let's open photoshop and as you can see we're gonna work with this face grid which is an asset that i'm gonna include as well in the description down below because this is something you're gonna need in order to create beauty filters so as you can see this grid have a lot of lines which is for us to have a referment point you know to know where to draw things you see even these red dots which are trackers and this is what both instagram and facebook use in order to track your face movement but we want to start creating a new layer because everything we're going to create and need to be saved in png format which means with the transparent background so create a new layer and you can rename it um, lip mask and then just grab your brush tool and select a quite soft brush and you want to start painting your lips with a white color on top of your face grid. And as you can see, I've created a black background for me to check if I'm actually um, drawing it decently because it's quite tricky when you have um, transparent, you know, face grid as a background to understand if you are designing your lips the right way. So once your lip mask is ready, just remove any background and save it as PNG. Then open your Sparkar Studio and uh, create a new project. The first things you want to do is to click the plus button on add object and select a face tracker. Then add a face mesh. Then go on your right panel and click the plus button next to material and then name your material lips. Then making sure your lips material is selected, go back on your right panel and then click on texture and import your lip mask PNG that we just create on Photoshop. And as you can see, you instantly have your lip mask on your model face and it's perfectly following her movements because we created a face tracker. So the next things you want to do is to use your lip mask as a canvas for you to create different type of lip effect. So go under diffuse and click on the color square and bring your sliders all the way into black. Then check the specular option. Go down on render option and on blend mode, click add. And voila, you instantly have gorgeous rose gold metallic lip effect. And this is just beautiful as it is but of course you can play around with the opacity to make it more um, prominent or more sheer so if you want to make it slightly more matte you bring the opacity down i personally love them just as shiny as possible so this is the first type of uh, lip effect that you can create now i want to show you how easy it is from this same panel to create a lip gloss effect instead so Keep all your values as they are and just go under specular and you want to bring the smoothness sliders all the way up. And there you have it, super glossy lips. Thank you. 
you can also play around with colors um, all you have to do is just bring back your smoothness to zero so go back into metallic mode and then click your color square and you can play around with your color wheel and experiment with different color shades this coral it's gorgeous for example and then again play with the opacity so you can make it brighter or more sheer I like to bring the opacity down a little bit it looks more natural but let me show you one last super cool lip effect I want to teach you how you can create a super sparkly lipstick by twigging a couple more things on your right panel check the normal option and then on texture you want to import your glitter texture which again I'm gonna include in the down below in the description box so check that section and there you have it super sparkling glittery lips gorgeous then you can adjust the smoothness to make them more intense or a bit more subtle three gorgeous lip effect in a matter of minutes I hope you enjoyed this mini tutorial if you did please remember to give a thumbs up and to leave a comment down below let me know if you enjoyed this type of tutorials and don't forget they have two full classes with tons of beauty filter effect or other filters effect on Skillshare. I'm gonna link them down below for you to have instant access to my classes for absolute zero cost and two full free months of premium membership on Skillshare where you can watch as many classes as you want. It's an amazing promotion so if you love to learn this type of stuff just check it out and don't miss out this opportunity.